Here we are at NIB Stadium. Uh, word on the street, there's a, uh, a new members area that's uh, popped up. It's uh, called the Corner Post. Let's see if we can sniff it out. <laughs> Righto, I've got Doug with me here. Uh, mate, can you tell us about this uh, your new vision for the Corner Post? Yeah, thanks Nick. Uh, so look, what we've done is we've had a really uh, uh, good pre-season talking to the people of the Western Force. What they're really keen to do is make sure that we have a really strong area for the members to come through. So those people that aren't necessarily interested in having the corporate experience or sitting inside one of the rooms, we've tried to create uh, probably something that you'd find internationally where we've got things like we've got a beautiful open barbecue area here. Yeah. We've introduced some craft beers on tap as well in the mid-strength range. Uh, we've got some new furniture and theming coming through the area. So the whole idea is this is the pre-game and the post-game destination for all the members to come on through, have a place that's uh, respectful of the fact that they've invested in membership with the Western Force. And we're really trying to uh, replicate what you might find in other parts of the world in terms of that, that pre-game experience. All right, mate, can you tell us uh, when the Corner Post uh, kicks off, when it's open? Yeah, absolutely. So we've uh, been really fortunate working with all of the stakeholders and licensing and so on. We'll be actually opening this bar available 90 minutes prior to kickoff. So we'd like to invite the members to come in, you know, come in nice and early. Look, there's plenty of great catering and opportunities around NIB Stadium. We're really fortunate. Local businesses uh, uh, really do a good job in terms of the hospitality, but we think that we've got an option here that will uh, really attract some people. So you're welcome to come on down. Uh, your colleagues in admin at Western Force as well have done a magnificent job. We're expecting some uh, identities to be in this area. We'll be having some people providing a commentary. There'll be music through the area as well. Uh, and all in all, the atmosphere is, let's have a nice wind up before the game. Let's really support the force. Nice wind up, absolutely. A couple of 90 minutes is plenty of time for that. And, um, and then plenty of time to uh, experience the emotional roller coaster to come. Yeah, no, I agree with you with that. Uh, I guess the other thing that we're really pleased with is post-game we're expecting, we might even see you up here after this game, we're expecting the man of match to come up about 15 minutes after the, the finish of play. So we're looking forward to seeing you up here on the stage with us. Uh, are you allowed to have a beer afterwards? Well, I think you might get sick of me up here after most games, but um, <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll have one with you, I'll have maybe a coldy and tell a few lies and um, talk about how good we were, um, how good you were back in the day. Yeah, great. All right, well, we'll put on a special price for the beers for you for after the game. And we might even throw in one of the sausages for you as well, mate. You beauty. There you have it, the corner post. Sounds like a screamer. Uh, well, look, there you go. Get down to the game here. We've got the Brumbies on the weekend. Um, I think uh, the force will put on a bit of a spectacle for you. So uh, park your carcass on a seat and cheer for the boys in blue.